to go in Tell me that I couldn't do it, but I gotta bring it back So they're really not with it Tell me where you're from, where you stay Not keep it lit from the coast to the bay Peace on the right if you guys are looking for cheap and instant Madden Ultimate Team coins, be sure to head over to MuttCoinBank.com and use promo code MAZE at checkout for 20% off. What is going on you guys, Mazomatic here, and for those of you who are still interested in Madden, or even for those of you who aren't interested in Madden anymore, which I know seems to be more and more people every day just kind of losing interest in the game, and I, I feel it, I'm kind of feeling the same way, that's why it's been harder to get uh, uploads out, just trying to get content going, just because Madden 17 seems to be kind of doling down, especially Ultimate Team, but... I feel like this is a good way to keep people interested is because EA Sports kind of released a little teaser thing today uh, about a little promo they're doing that's actually going to carry over into Madden 18. And uh, before I get into that, I kind of want to look at the content that was dropped yesterday. And this is kind of an example of why people are losing so much interest in Madden 17. Um, so if we look at Mutthead on the home screen, the first thing they're talking about is the new uh, movers groups, the group 8 of the NFL movers. And if this isn't the biggest joke I've ever seen a 99 overall fullback as the the main guy Patrick DeMarco and to make it even more ridiculous this dude this is his fifth card his fifth elite card like what is Patrick DeMarco done that is so special that he deserves five cards like I don't know many other cards that even have five cards at all like receivers and stuff like that like I don't know this is just weird to me five cards for this fullback and he's 99 overall I don't even know how much he's going for he's going for like probably like either 500k to a mil somewhere in there for a fullback which I think is kind of ridiculous. I'm um, looking at the comments on his Mutthead card. Uh, it's pretty funny. People are pretty upset about it. Uh, he got 84 dislikes on the, the reveal on Mudhead. If you guys know what Mudhead is, it's just kind of like a, a Madden Ultimate Team website. They kind of go over all the content. It's like people making accounts and stuff. And people saying stuff like, this is the biggest troll card of the year. Why EA? Confirmed EA doesn't care anymore. Like... <laughs> It just really seems like, yeah, this is exactly what it is. EA just does not seem to care anymore. Like, a 99 overall fullback for this group of movers is not going to keep anybody interested. It's losing losing a lot of interest, and this is just another reason why people are losing interest. Um, but to the thing I was talking about earlier, something that's a little bit more interesting and uh, uh, something that's going to keep people more interested because of the carrying over into Madden 18, which obviously everyone wants to do, is little teaser tweets they've been putting on their Twitter. So if you don't follow... EA Sports uh, Ultimate Team on Twitter. I'd recommend it because you get uh, little things like this. The tweet says, Loyalty player and set preview coming on Twitter today. Stay tuned. Program launch tomorrow. Loyalty Madden 18 uh, from EA Sports. So that is obviously an official account. Um, they're tweeting that they're going to have a teaser out. And then I, I don't know if this is the teaser they were talking about. They put a little graphic out um, that has to do with tokens. So it says complete weekly objectives and you earn tokens. And then if you trade them in, you will get uh, the rewards there are listed on the right. The best you can get is 10 tokens for a 99 overall player. And I see DeAndre Hopkins is uh, like the image right next to it. So I don't know if that's uh, like a hint DeAndre Hopkins are going to release a new player or something. And then uh, the tweet itself, it says complete objectives, earn tokens, redeem for packs and players right now, plus get rewards in the next Madden. So that makes me think, obviously that uh, something is going to carry over. And it's talking about loyalty, which is uh, loyalty badges are something that we've gotten in past Maddens that you can use at the very beginning of the next Madden. So I have a feeling uh, you're going to be able to get some loyalty badges and stuff with these tokens. And I don't, they haven't really released anything else on what, what goes into these tokens or anything like that. Just this like weird graphic that kind of says what the tokens get you. We don't really know what to do to get a token. Obviously weekly objectives, but it's just one a week because if it's one a week, and you gotta get 10 tokens for 99 overall player. That seems a bit extreme. But the rewards do seem pretty sweet. I have a feeling you're gonna be able to get like one one or two tokens a week. Uh, that's just what it seems like to me. But anyways, this is a little teaser that they have put out on their Twitter. And I'm actually gonna be starting a new series on the channel to kind of uh, wind down the Madden year. I'm gonna be building up my team. I'm gonna be getting a few million coins and um, building a really nice team. And then as I play games, every game I lose, I'm gonna be giving away a player on the team. So eventually, I'm probably going to be giving away a lot of players. I'm going to be replacing those players with bronze players. And so the bronze players eventually are going to fill up the whole team, and then I'm just going to have a really bad team. But um, if you do want to see those giveaways, be sure to follow me on Twitter. My link to my Twitter my Twitter account will be in the description down below. Um, but I'm going to be starting that most likely in the next couple days, and there will be another video kind of going over that a little bit more. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, again, sorry for the lack of content. I've been sick and just really busy, and obviously Madden is kind of dull to a lot of people right now but um, I'm gonna be getting more content out soon hopefully the the new series that I'm talking about is gonna be a little bit more exciting uh, and I will see you guys in the next video